Greetings, signs and moons. We're going to go ahead and get into channeling this energy, okay? So you were dealing with a soulmate in the past, okay? You may have went back to this person. Um, and you may have uh, got yourself stuck here. Others of you, you're dealing with uh, a loved one, all right? So you may want to apologize to this person, but you have some maturing to do, especially if this is surrounding a spiritual gift, okay? So... A message of clarity and our truth was spoken about work or lack thereof. Maybe you weren't able to get work or this person wasn't. All right, so somebody may be a perfectionist, okay? So this is an individual that you want to go back to or you want to come towards you, all right? That would be your spiritual spouse, so that's not for everyone. All right, so you were in a relationship where you were constantly being tested and or tried, tried and true. So somebody may have been doing something repetitively to like try to master something. I feel like they came in with some sort of distorted communication here. All right. This could, this could have been something that someone tried to attach to you while you were sleeping. Nighttime is significant. All right. So you may have had to leave at night. All right. You may have also got yourself in a situation where you had to defend yourself and you may have ended up in uh, litigation. Com combining assets, speaking the truth here. I feel like if you were in this partnership with the soulmate here, this could be a soulmate of a lower vibration. Your energy was thrown off here. Archangel Gabriel could be significant. So we're talking about um, competition and our strife. Somebody may also say or call on Archangel Michael. They may not know uh, who they're calling on actually here. Or this is you. All right, so... In the past, you gained some sort of clarity of why you were stuck. This could be some mess, like a message that was revealed to you by your spiritual spouse. This has something to do with you moving forward. You realize why you move forward. I'm getting that energy of no love lost, okay? All right, so you may be going back to the past here to renew something, okay? Others of you, somebody's going back to a past person and giving an offering. This could be like a deity and or energy that somebody's working with. I feel like if that is the case, they're going to um, like run into a tower here. Somebody's not going to be able to move forward. They may realize something is final. Or you will. Ether, tell me what it is I need to see. Yeah. So it's going to leave somebody in regret. So the advice is if this is you trying to give an offering, uh, that, that, you know, this has something something to do with the elect one. You need to, you need to go within. If somebody's doing this to a healer, okay, yeah, strife. So you're realizing why. I feel like multiple people are realizing why. It could be family members. This could be like frenemies, fake friends that you had to leave, uh, like you had to leave from or release. If you went back to the past here, you had to redo something. These are people, these will be individuals that are in secret competition with you. Okay, so yeah, a cycle was not complete. Somebody was doing some sort of research. This person could have been up all night. All right, others of you, there was a heavy weight lifted off of you. It could have something to do with the karmic debt. Sealed, something is sealed. You can show me what it is I need to see. Ooh, okay. So, yeah, we're talking about soulmate energy. Somebody's dealing with somebody that is unethical. This is who you partner with. For some of you, this is a friend of me. They may have been telling you to go towards somebody that you have a karmic contract with. This is what kept you stuck. Or you were doing this to somebody here. All right, and you may have gotten left out of the cold. Left out in the cold. Either show me what it is I need to see. Okay. So this person didn't do their equal share. All right. So you kept going back to someone repeating past cycles here. I feel like this person is no longer able to move forward or to move in your direction. They may be experiencing some issues with their finances and or you. Either show me what it is. Okay. So, <clears throat> for somebody, this has something to do with the marriage. All right, so this is also changing the belief 
uh, system as well. You could also be like mastering something. You can show me what it is I need to see. Okay, so yeah, you're no longer in regret. I feel like he had to clear something up, especially if he kept going back to the past here uh, to renew something or redo something. This has, you have to do this to receive this offer. Yeah. Somebody could be waiting on you. Okay, so for somebody, this is like a soulmate. This is someone that's going to keep you uh, stuck here. I feel like this individual has their head in the clouds, or you do. Yeah, you feel like this is a, a burden here. So that nine of wands turns into a ten of wands really quickly, especially if you're still in a partnership. This could be a partnership that you don't know about. At least people think, yeah. So somebody was trying to confuse you. And that's the tower. Uh, others of you, you're going to have multiple options here. You can show me what it is. Empress. So you're realizing something about this Empress here. Or they're realizing something about you. Something that was hidden. Somebody that wants you to see this offer as abundant. Or you didn't. Yeah. So, for some of you, this is a soulmate of a lower vibration. Uh, it could be platonic. This could be like a collaboration. These are people that's going up against you and your spiritual spouse. This could also be you offering something to someone that has like a lot of karmic debt. Something being sealed. Some information being sealed. Others of you, you're getting your spiritual spouse here. All right, so somebody may be trying to like send you combative energy or confuse you about who your person is but this is something that is spiritual you may connect with this person on the spiritual on the spiritual realm okay and they may be confused they don't know the difference between spiritual realm and spirit realm and uh you know part three of this will be on tier three deuces